Hi, this is Marty with SB Search Marketing, and we're going to be going over the multiplier tool right now. Um, so basically what the multiplier tool does, say we have a list of keywords. You have blue, green, yellow. Um, I write everything in Excel so they're really ridiculously easy to manipulate the data rather than using one of those other systems. Um, we have blue, green, yellow, red now, um, and then we're going to have shoe, shoes, sandal, sandals, boot, and as you see here, we have misspelling. So one of the problems with one of those other systems, uh, the online systems and so forth, is that you can't do a spell check real quick. So we're going to do a spell check, and we realize, uh, okay, um, not only is uh, sandal or boots misspelled, but sandals misspelled too. So we're going to change that. We're going to change that. We're going to change boots. Okay, perfect. I didn't even realize sandals was misspelled. Um, now we're going to run a multi merge. Okay, so what this did is it created blue shoe, blue shoes, blue sandal, blue sandals, blue boot, on down the line. Um, now this is a tool that many people, many websites out there have, but here's the difference in my tool, um, is now there's variations of it. So this is one of the standard variations, let's say you're doing a uh, plumber in Los Angeles, plumber in, you know, and so what I do is I put the uh, one of the standard columns that comes out is in. Um, next one is uh, just swaps it. Um, so you could do both of them at the same time rather than having to move the columns back and forth. Um, shoe blue, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense, but you know what if you wanted to do that? It did make sense for that particular run. Um, here you have from. Okay, so let's change this box in here, and we're going to do Nike. And let's run it again. So you have blue Nike shoe, blue Nike shoes. Uh, so this is basically it's it's what I call a connector. Um, it's a special character within uh, between the two uh, uh, terms. You could do and, you could do uh, all kinds of different little things as long as you put it in there. Um, here you have blue shoe with a space or with no space. You also have blue dash shoe, um, blue shoe dot com and blueshoe.net. That was for a special project that I was doing, and I just left the macro in there because yeah, sometimes it makes sense. Um, you could uh, you could basically try to go after some of those uh, terms that are all .coms and so forth. Uh, if somebody types in uh, some uh, .com into the Google search bar, so that's it for the multiplier tool.